Mr Speaker. I call Sarah Dowie. Uh, Mr Speaker, thank you. Um, I only have the opportunity uh, of a short call in support of this bill, but before I do so, I acknowledge the family members of the victims of Pike and other workplace uh, tragedies in other sectors across New Zealand, especially agriculture, which plays a big part in the uh, my electorate of Invercargill. Uh, I, I support this bill for a couple of reasons. I do believe that it will create a step change in health and safety in New Zealand. And the first which has been covered has been with respect to worker engagement and participation. Uh, this reform bill will make that mandatory and we've already heard speakers from this side of the House talk about a vertical integration of health and safety up uh, to management and down to the workers. It also uh, means that a worker uh, will be able to uh, stop works if they see something uh, that could uh, create harm. So um, I think that that step change will create a culture where it brings um, health and safety to the fore of um, employees and employers' uh, minds. The other thing is this new concept of a PCBU person conducting business or undertaking. And that is an acknowledgement that in some workplaces uh, there are overlapping duties. And so that will force uh, operators or people uh, conducting businesses uh, to talk and to cooperate. And so far where they have the ability to control that matter or influence that matter, uh, they will need to take account of that and put in place practical <laughs> measures uh, to protect uh, their employees. Um, I want to pick up on a point that uh, the Honourable Morris Williams made uh, with respect to balance. Uh, we do need to maintain a balance in this legislation, and that is especially the case with respect to agriculture. We all realise that agriculture too has uh, a high number of deaths, and that is unacceptable. But Farming is the backbone of New Zealand, especially in the Invercargill electorate, and we need to preserve uh, the family's right to raise their children on the farm. And that, what has been seen with respect to that is the change in definition of workplace in that work must be being carried out. So the children still can go out on the farm and run and play and enjoy a rural lifestyle, um, but when they're in the milking shed, uh, they will need to be taken uh, into the care um, and, and, and basically uh, held uh, responsible to the health and safety plans that that farmer um, should have. So I believe that that is a good balance. It preserves uh, rural life and that will certainly uh, feed through into other sectors. So I support this bill. Well